Hi there again everyone, this is Bob Martin with the Nautilus Dry Docks and I wanted to share with you this uh, finished custom replica 66 and a half inch Nautilus static display model. This one's not RC, uh, but it's got a lot of cool features I wanted to show it to you. So let's take a look. So this is the 66 and a half inch custom replicas Nautilus model, 135th scale. Uh, this is the RC variant that Jim Key put together and you can see there's a, a hull split right here that runs down the length of the boat and the idea behind that was the entire top section could be lifted off to give you access to the internal components. This has been done up as a display model and you can see that that seam uh, is really tight. It's laser straight. Jim did just a beautiful job in setting this up. This particular model was originally built up by a friend of mine by the name of Tom Martin. He did a really nice job as well. The paint finish really replicating like a bronze patina. All of the uh, hatches have been made to be functional. Uh, that's on the back dorsal area as well as the front of the wheelhouse and underneath uh, this is held closed magnetically you can see a magnet uh, in there and there is a light actually that shines down from that area as well the model has practical lighting and you can see on this side of the boat where that works we've got a power lead that plugs in right there and then we've got three switches because there's three different lighting circuits uh, on the boat. So to turn it on, you just reach behind and, and turn on the relevant lighting circuit. There's lots of beautiful details uh, inside, including backlit gauges. Uh, there's some ultraviolet LEDs, ship's wheel, the dive levers. So this model also has a fully detailed salon area that you can view inside there with the curtains, the lower pit area there, the steps, the settee couch, and the specimen table. Adds a lot of really nice visual interest to the boat. We've got a removable skiff in the boat with some rudder details that were added by Tom. So my next step is going to be to pack the boat up and uh, I'm going to do a separate video on what that actually entails because as you can see uh, it's going to be a challenge to ship this out safely. We're going to do the best that we can. So thanks for joining me. Keep an eye out for my next video and we'll catch you next time.